why, hello there. Hello there. Welcome, everybody, back to Spoop Timber. We took a little bit of a break there. One day, I'm no, I'm sorry, I really wanted to play Divinity, but we're back and we're playing Layers of Fear today. Now, I've heard that this game is like four hours long or some shit, so I'm not expecting a whole lot to happen, but um, you know what? Fuck it, man. We can do it. And if it's a very short game, we've got plenty more to play, so. Let's load up Booty Town. Okay. Layers of Fear is a unique, immersive game experience in which every decision affects the narrative. As in life, it is the doors you open, the memories you take with you, and the shadows you explore that define who you are. This may be our game, but it is your journey. Okay. Uh, new game! Great. Didn't even fill up the loading bar. What was the point of having it? I know how you must feel. Lost. Tired. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. Thanks. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. Could go back in time. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Fear to penis. I mean, uh... Finish it. P hey, what up? Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh, are we actually playing? Oh, God. Is he drunk? Is this, is this going to be the drunk wobble? Did you kill mommy? No, she's just dead and drunk. Okay. Um, what the fuck? It seems like... Like this V-Sync on or something? Sorry. Aha! Uh -huh. Off. And you know what? Turn that... Crank that bitch up. Crank that bitch up! Woo! Brr brr. I still feel like racing some. What the fuck? What? Off. Oh. Uh, oh, there's an apply button down there. Right, that makes sense. What? Fuck you. Alright, well, uh. I guess we're restarting the game. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I've ruined everything. Mm hmm Photosensitivity. If you have epilepsy, be warned. Be warned. Alright. Hopefully this should fix all the fucking stupid... It looks like shit. Uh... Yeah, I might as well start from the beginning. I don't know, we'll just continue. Like... It honestly, oh, that's so much better. Like capping the the thing, the resolute. Oh, okay. So it's got that mechanic and stuff, right? I don't know what to expect with this game. An artist triumph, gallery opening, wows critics. Some call him the Cacavego. Others compare compare him to Van Eyck, a one all-star critic who wished to remain unnamed, went as far to invoke the spirit of great Leonardo. In any way you slice it, the exhibition proved immense success. Uh, uh, retracted, its distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of Renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in company with his beautiful fiance, looking stunning in a black gown. Retracted revealed to us exclusively the couples are indeed expecting 
their first child, probably. Oh, you can press space bar and read it without the cool text. Is this gonna be a reading game? Fuck! Okay. Dear sir, I'd like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialist, as well as to refrain from spending any more of the highly... sending any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. Accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of rodent infestation of any kind. As such, decided not to act further than a uh, prophylactic, prophylactic spraying. Really? They did prophylactic sprayings? All right. Please treat this letter as a final warning or else we'll envelop you. The next envelope you will receive will envelop you. The next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. Carl Denton. That's a fucking good asshole name, by the way. Carl Denton. Puckle. The dog or some shit. Figured to be up all night, so I made you a little treat. You know, I bet even Rembrandt occasionally took time off from being brilliant and shoved his and showed oh showed his head uh, and snored his head off like the rest of us common folk. I know, gasp. In other words, get some sleep, you big dummy. I love you. I don't know about love, but I mean, he seems pretty nice so far. I paint the fruit! Paint one. Rose deer burnt under. Uh, paint. Rose deer burnt amber sienna brushes. Yeah. I'm a reading all the game. What? Actually, let's leave that open. Anything we've looked at, it's gonna leave open. Well, I'm a. Mm. Okay. I don't know what to expect from this game. It's probably gonna be spoopy, like, the paintings are looking at me funny. I'm gonna be that guy. Can I take any of these things? Is that the painter? Mm, fuck you, painting man. So, I didn't touch the workshop just like you asked, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. Brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. I need keys for my own fucking house. Why is there so many fucking broken bottles? What the fuck? What kind of fucking door opens in that direction? <laughs> yeah, we fuck rats. Got a rat problem? Call us. And fuck it for it. Forget about it. What year is this taking place in? I mean, if they're writing posters to each other, it must be a pretty late year. Oh, 
Oh, I get to see myself. Oh, one sec, guys. It's my meal. It's my pasta. Um, so I'll keep playing. I'm just going to be eating. You won't see me because that's rude and gross. And why would you want to watch a man eat? Looking at you in real life streams. So uh, yeah, let's keep this party going.
Dumpling all around, dumpling all around, dumpling all around, it's so funny. Dumpling here and there, dumpling everywhere, and I must declare, I stepped right on her toes, and when she... All right, sorry about that. Mmm, pasta is good. If you want to see what I ate, check out the Discord. Posted a picture. Because that's the type of basic bitch I am. So from what I've gathered so far, the guy has a limp. Maybe has a prosthetic in his knee. Some shit. Um, had a kid. Had a wife. And that's about all I've gotten so far. Oh. Maybe had an accident, went down on his life, so. Might not be a household name just yet, but give her time. The incredibly talented multi instrumentalist gave an astounding performance last night, winning over even our most ardent naysayers. She was simply outstanding. I haven't seen such passion, energy, and skill in years. Stated fame pianist Daniel Richer. Richter. Uh, he was not alone in his praise, it seems, that even Anthony Giles. One of redact redacted harshest critics has finally seen the light. Giles previously made a disparage disparaging comment about the artist, stating that there's more to performing music than enthusiasm and a pretty face. When asked if her, after witnessing last night's performance, he regrets those words, Mr. Giles gave us a look that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Press for an answer, he simply said yes. We caught up with the star redacted. Okay. That's good. So the hus the wife might be a penis and the husband might be a painter. What an odd couple. Okay, no one's in the bed. Someone broke the mirror though. Disastrous fire, the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. 
long-awaited opening of the uh, galactic department store turned into hell on earth when the building's wiring burst into flames while the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building having no chance to escape the raging inferno the exact number of casualties have not yet been determined although it is estimated that at least a dozen people have been severely injured the owner of the galactic uh, ronald sheffield has so far declined to comment on today's tragic event and i got the hiccups great why is there a lot of fans that seems weird to me Sorry, I couldn't sleep. Legs be necked up again. Figured might as well do some work. I love you. That sounds like me. So am I playing that guy? <sighs> the bottles fucking got me. Fuck you, game. How did the bottles get me? God fucking damn it. Ugh. Why is there a fucking cupboard in the bedroom that's filled with fucking bottles anyway? So dumb. Is this blood or wine? Alright, well, we got the keeper downstairs, so we might as well go back down. Okay, one of the paintings is missing. Lovely. That could only mean one thing. Okay, the door shut on its own then. <sighs> when you looked at the mirror, it had something right on it. I didn't see that. It's gonna be a picture of my death! Covered up for a raisin. Okay, I mean, get it right this time. Can I paint it? Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. All right. Well, how do I fucking paint? Just sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done before you go to sleep. That would suck. It's like living in the same house with someone and text messaging them. Okay, so what? He's a war veteran? I don't get the sound effect, but that's a lot of brushes. where I keep the dead bodies. Well, I guess we can't do anything here, right? Okay, well, it's different. So that's good. Of course, the door shuts automatically. What the? That's weird. Okay. Just out of reach. It's gonna be a different hallway. Yeah. Okay. It's gonna be one of those games, huh? Going in circles. Yeah, I am. How did you know, game? <sighs> Go into a room, trigger a thing. Okay, 
read this? Like, I, this is the first note that I can't read? Some of these paintings are getting fucked up. What the fuck? Okay, well, we're gonna find a key. Save the date of Blaine Blair. Request the pleasure of company and they celebrate their wedding on the Saturday the 9th during at Luke's Chapel, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I don't know. Oh. Wait, is this an American game? <clears throat> I have the June, so it would be seven nine two. Mm. Maybe two seven nine. Nine seven. Two o'clock in the afternoon. Ninth <clears throat> of June. Oh, it's six. Why is it? Why was I thinking it was seven? I'm an idiot. Is there like a confirm button I'm supposed to put in here? Hmm. Ninth of June, two p.m. Why isn't this fucker working? Okay, well it might not be that. Oh. Oh. Four, eight, five. Here I was thinking I had to read things. The pass holds back. Look closer. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Oh, that's kind of nice. Where's the key to the fucking door, though? Never forget. Okay, well, how about we go through this door, then? So we need to literally just interact with everything and that's how you get through the game. Dearie me. Looks like you know how to get ahead of yourself. Oh, fucking what? <laughs> ah, yes, the old hanging upside down uh, baby trap door. Hmm? 
Oh. My love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I never have been a deeply religious person. I guess what other people look for in a sermon, I found in perfecting my art. But now, I can't help but feel there's another higher power watching over me. They once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. Now I'm playing sold-out concerts at some, very, at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character and I'll never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own. And yet, here you are within me. I'm quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Uh, hmm. Is this like a... Um, Jesus Christ, Grandma. Scared the poop out of me. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Maybe she made a pact with the devil or some shit. Don't you hate it when you make art and then it comes to life and scares you? Ugh. Ah, oh, yes. The old hanging baby from the deer trick. <clears throat> God, this fucking old lady's following me around. It's giving me the willies. Eh. Oh yes, the hallway with all my haunted paintings. Paint deep lies. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> wow, you're fucking weird, dude. Paint me like one of your French girls. Man, he has a lot of weird... Like, if he painted all these, that's fucking strange, in a way. Alright, I'll buy a game. What's this giant painting about? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so we just walk around looking at paintings and then we get spooked? Cool, man. Hey, bro. It is kind of spoopy, I will say that. More spoopy than so far the other games that I've played. It's kind of weird, like, this game went through, like, early access and shit, um, and it had a lot of, like, well, now you can play this room sort of updates. It's always been a game that I've been hesitant to play just because of that reason. <laughs> Thinking that uh, maybe they hadn't Hello? finished it all. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I what? mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Okay. It's okay, wife. I'm not painting anymore, I promise. Uh, the one towards the light. That's generally how video games work, right? We're back in the funny fucking attic again. <sighs> it's really dark. I can barely see anything. First step is the hardest. Okay. 
The kitchen. Right. Is there a baby in the oven? What's making that fucking sound? Oh. There's fruit coming out of the painting. Babies in the oven. Did I like kill my baby or some shit? Is it just suddenly not open now? Ooh. That's kind of cool. Okay, I'll go towards the painting. Bountiful. First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hands steady. Booze does the opposite to my hands. Did I like fucking kill some people? What's going on there? So we're going this way now. And here we are, back in the studio. How's the speed been going? Yeah, we got speed by some bottles. Hate even now, lost. You deserve it. Finish it. Fuck. This is the painting that I'm coming out with? Some Dark soul shit? Shapeless dreams. Deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes. Then you're over a hump. So, how hard... What's so hard about it? Oh, here's the yips. Haha. <laughs> ah, uh, what an asshole. This is just like a guided tour on the fuck you stations. Wait, we have a fucking elevator in this house? Good god, man. Uh, okay, I think there's one way. Did I miss something? Pass catches up. <clears throat> so we went up four fucking stories in this house. That's the part I find the hardest to believe, that his house is so fucking big. That he has an elevator. If it was a figment of his imagination, that's one thing, but it's clearly not because... It clearly works. <sighs> okay. Spook me game. <laughs> Hello, painting. Uh, dear sir, uh, why I can't, uh, why I can certainly understand that you're upset. I have nothing but sympathy for you and your wife, for your wife and yourself. I must categorically state that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure. Uh, having stated that, I assure you that me and my colleagues at the St. Anne have made every effort to ensure a positive outcome for your wife. Excuse me. 
I'm personally speaking, I, I believe that we have done the best job can possible considering the extent of the tissue damage. You are, of course, entitled to your opinion, and I can certainly understand your disappointment. What I do not understand is how you seem to think that writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will emoliate the situation. <clears throat> As I've already stated, I can certainly understand that you've been under a lot of stress of late, and thus I will not press charges if you refrain from any further correspondence. Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information for several specialists who would be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regard to your and best wishes for you and your wife, William H. Green, M.D. Give me that fucking... <laughs> What the fuck? What was the point of picking up the fucking key then? Whatever. I have a key now. Paintings! I'm here to erase you. Hmm, the house is on fire. So, what, was there a house fire? And my wife got burnt, and maybe I... Oh, what is this, Binding of Isaac now? Did I put the baby in a fucking box? Ugh. Baby on board. Okay. So what, we're back in this fucking... Oh wait, we've never been in this hallway. Aha! See, there are rats in this fucking house. Back in this deer room. So what? Keep rolling, 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 yeah. What the fucking roof fell on me? Oh, that was a door? Well, I mean like, what, is there poltergeist in this house? It's gonna be one of those things where I have to look in the mirror at the text or some shit. Of course I don't have a fucking reflection. Is that even spinning? Undone, can I be undone? Well, we're in the mirror world now. There ain't no going back. This ain't no Mario Sunshine. What up, doggos? You know what's the best part about this game is that someone had to make all these fucking paintings. Like someone, they had to fucking 
Potentially actually pay someone to make all these fucking paintings. You want this as well. Because a lot of them would have had to be edited. Okay, cool, I guess. What is this, Cry Fear now? I didn't shut that door. Pain fever dream. All the paintings are smaller. A lot of artists paint fucked up shit. Yeah, but to have like, like that dog painting, for example, um, to have like a picture, like the dog painting, and then have like the full, like undead dog painting, at the same time. Yeah, the my fans are throwing themselves at my feet. Hmm. Um. Could you fucking stop or like kill me with it? I don't know. One of the two. Um. But yeah, you would. They would have had to make like two variations on the same painting, which means that at least some of the paintings. And they all would have had to have a consistent style too. Or else it doesn't make sense. Man, I got the hiccup something fierce right now. Oh, the door's open now. Yo, what up? It's your boy, Spook Town. Got the key, yo. Is there like a fucking order to them or something? Stop it. There are rats in the wall or something like that? Yeah, yeah, I'll be there in a sec. The walls are like getting covered by shit and uncovered. Am I missing something here? What am I supposed to be fucking doing? Oh. The old wedding photo. Sweet. Mm hmm. The old hidden brandy, my favorite. Ah, yes. My diary of sweet pandas. Okay. Yo, what up, dude? This house this is house absolutely is amazing. amazing. Oh, but those stairs. With that leg of mine, I think you'll have to carry me to the bedroom once we move in. Who the fuck says that? Use the handrail. You're walking just fine now, asshole. Now yeah, we've been in here before. Unleash your inner beauty with a new Glamour Fusion Max. Say well, say well, to our acne scars and large pores and other unpleasant skin conditions. The new Glamour F Max Fusion Concealer will give your skin a healthier look and a smoother feel. Don't think of it as covering up different uh, defiances. Think of it as unleashing your inner beauty. Great, now they've got ads in indie games. Unheard of. Protheus snatch Protheus snatches. Insatiable bastards. Why the damn leg? Can't afford a new one. Someone stole his leg? What the fuck for? 
Who throws a shoe? Honestly. Oh, well, I guess they want me to do this, huh? Now that's kind of cool looking. Yeah, I was wondering, like, it actually was like, why is it all in reverse? That's kind of a cool effect. I like it. Good job, game. Everything's melty. Yeah, drink this poison. I needed a jar and a plastic tubing. I siphoned gas before. I knew how it was done. I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth. What the fuck? Then put the tube in the jar and it just kept coming. The taste of copper haunted me the entire night. Why didn't I think of a syringe? How the fuck did you get a tube in your arm? Um... That's my first question. Can we leave by this door? Hello? Honey, what in the world are you doing? What did the doctor say about straining yourself? Leave that thing alone. It's not going anywhere. Okay. So I got some blood. If I speed it up. Is it like upside down? Dumpling all around, dumpling all around, dumpling all around. It's so funny. Dumpling here and there, dumpling everywhere. See, that's cool. Look at that. I stepped right on her toes. And when she bumped my nose, I fell. And when I rose, I fell to Dumpling all around, dumpling all around, dumpling all Still a lot of blood around the bed. Actually, there's blood everywhere now. Cool. <sighs> okay. Back to the painting. Hey, even now, lost alone. You deserve it. A grave for you. Finish it. The horsey? Uh. Oh. I first looked for a canvas, not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be sharp as a razor. So I used a ra razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped my hands steady. I needed a jar of plastic tubing. Okay, so it's just repeating. So what the, that means is like four more things I gotta find. Alright. Okay, it's weird that that's locked off like that. Mark! 
big nice. I just wanted to play the fucking piano, man. Alright, I get it. You don't want me to play the piano. Why is there a Geiger counter going off? The music's pretty cool. Creator's block. Yeah. Hey, what up, Riga? How you doing, man? Oh. Creepy. That's supposed to be my waifu? November 9th. Oh, June 9th. That's when he was supposed to get married. I guess. I don't know my own strength, huh? September 15th. More notes today, even worse than before. Sad part is, I agree with every word. How long were they married before they started fucking hating each other? has a lot of books. Why does he have so many books? That's my biggest question. What? I need to fucking do something about my neighbors. They're the worst. Kids, right? Dude needs a housekeeper? No, oh, he needs a fucking... He needs the Ghostbusters, that's what he needs. That's like a PT sort of scene. Like, up there. Yeah, man, fuck PT. The game was like, the worst. So like a fucking dial tone or some shit. <laughs> yep, I'm too good at video games. Yeah, this is like some PT shit right now. <laughs> So. Any spoof shit? Yeah. Um, some wine. Some wine fell out of the cupboard and I got scared. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's like a... Restless memory. Okay. All right. 
I'll pay that one. I'll pay that one. <sighs> Turn the door in here. I can't read that. Freed thoughts or something? I guess. Oh, well that's convenient. Now give me this letter. Flapping horror, be quiet. Constantly flapping. Eating other rats? Lovely. I mean, it wouldn't be too hard to make an upside down room. Really. Hmm. That's kind of cool. I don't get it. Like, is my wife supposed to be dead or some shit? Like, she the is she the poltergeist? Did I like cut off her skin for some reason? Fucking who knows, man. In any case, as your lawyer, I advise you to refrain from doing any imprudent actions. In other words, don't do anything stupid. We still have a chance of winning this. Believe it or not, I've gotten clients out of deeper shit than this. Just don't make it any worse. Lay low for a while. Let me appeal to the court order. The so social worker definitely has it in for you. We can use that to our advantage, betraying you as a victim of the system, a husband in mourning. Okay, so my wife is dead. A momentary lapse of reason. An overzealous bureaucrat. Trust me. This is our best option. Considering what you've been through lately, I'd say you have a good 50-50 chance of a good outcome. 50-50? Fucking hell. You must have a pretty terrible life if that's the case. Yeah, that's cool, man. Um... But not if you keep trying to convince everyone that you've gone completely sane. No more outbursts, no more rambling, but yet, no more public appearances whatsoever. You can still get, you, st you can still get your daughter. I'm guessing it's what that was meant to say, but they retracted it. Jeez, I don't think there'd be any violent shaking women in this game. Well, what do I know? Violent shaking women are my favorite. Those are just good. Oh, God. Did she fucking kill herself in the bathroom? Oh, baby dead. Silent floaters, they clog the drains. Fur and water, no baths for me. Bye, baby. Someone left the toilet seat up. Unacceptable. If 
Fuck you, ghost, trying to stop me from leaving. This is just a fucking walking simulator. I mean, I get that it's frightening, but like... It's just a fucking walking simulator. Hey, what up? I needed to remove the flesh from the bone. At first, I was lost as to how, but then I sawed it off with a handsaw, boiled it, then put the bone in a mortar. I had to get one, obviously. This was not something I'd done before. Finally, I mixed the dust with some white paint. It made for a lovely undercoat. He's making paint out of his wife. Fucking gross, dude. At least how I read the situation. Aha, uh -huh, we're back here. I hate, even now, lost, alone, hopeless. You'll always be a, grote a grotesque misunderstanding. Finish it. This is going to be my wife coming out of the painting to eat me. Or some shit. Really? Is she gonna eat me if I go and don't ignore her? It's my kid's painting, I guess. The kid's not very good, he's kinda dumb actually. Drunk!
You really hated this game? Now, Observer, that was a shit. Really? I mean, this game is kind of just like... A big walking thing. Kids doing some stuff. Oh, that's kind of cool. That... That is cool. I enjoyed that. No, that's not right. Try again. Don't give me that look. What do we do when we fail? We start over. You're better than this. Now sit down and this time, let's make it perfect. Maybe I wasn't too far off the mark about him being like fucking kid's trash. Trash kid. Not even a real painter. He's a shit painter. See? That is cool. That's legitimately cool instead of the fucking ghost lady walking around. What you got for me, Mr. Bear? Nothing? Alright. Well, we can't go that way. Make your unicorn better, you shit! Baby feet. <laughs> Sweet Jesus. Jesus! Did you just buy Jesus. half of the department store? Honey, you don't even know yet if it's gonna be a boy or a girl. Doesn't matter, you ignorant swine. Is that like the kid? Like the doll or whatever? That's fucking stupid. The doll represents my dead child! Who would have thought? Yeah, it's a beating heart. Cool. Alright, you wanna play, ghost? Let's play. I'll kick your ass at checkers. Alright, so we need to find one more white checker, I guess. Got him. Oh, I know, there's... I guess there's still one missing. I didn't see that missing one. Here we go. You beat me again. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder why I even bother. <laughs> Good thing we didn't bet on it. <laughs> what? What's so funny? Okay. Talking behind our backs. The the child aspect of this is pretty legitimately cool. Like the the kids' drawings and shit, especially that that the horse with the fire thing. That was pretty awesome. I don't know about the doll part though, but everything else is cool. I can get down with the kids' drawings coming to life. <sighs> okay. That one got me. That one got me. I'll give you that one.
None of the shit afterwards was any effective, but the fucking that little head part was. Yeah, hey, what up, baby? Did I miss the spoof or something? Wiggle, 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 yeah. Hey, what up? Babies everywhere. when I got a vasectomy. I didn't zoom in, that was the game doing it for me. Like, I... Is it supposed to make me feel something? Like... Whoa. Man, what a bad LSD trip that was. Go this way. What? Squiggle, 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 yeah. Sydney! The TV's leaking! I fucking love scary movie, man. Yes, give up like always. Alright. I will, if I can. Inspired OCD. Thanks, game. Thanks for the fucking shout out. Why does that look? Okay, I guess we need to find a music box key. Yo, I'm here to turn this shit up to 11. Let's go. All aboard the hype train, motherfuckers. Jack in the Box is a fucking disgustingly creepy guy, I just say. Don't you hate it when your dog gets a, like, 45 extra eyes? Mm. 
when they won't stop talking. <laughs> oh, the baby's just fucking banging his head against the wall. Daddy went crazy. Hush, little baby, the night is the star. Daddy's gonna poop out his cigar. Stars fade above you, the room goes dark. Check out all these baby parts that I own. Mama used to come to tuck you in. Okay. Now she's nowhere to be seen. Because I killed her. Hey, what up, baby face? It's me, your dad. I'm gonna take this bowl with me, man. Ugh. I'm locked inside the kids' room again, honey. This was a special brush. Like a horsehair brush, but different. At that point, I hesitated. Will this really work? Fuck it. I was already halfway through, and besides, it's not like I can just put it all back and forget the whole thing. Motherfucker using his family as parts for his painting. That's pretty fucked up, dude. Not gonna lie. Picture the doors are open now? Is that how this works? <laughs> Something wrong with your face, kid. Babies, yeah. Look at all the babies I got, babies, yeah. I hate, even now, lost, alone, hopeless, You've always been alone, you always will be, hoping a grave era, finish it. Is this gonna be a self-portrait? Gone. Alright, so we've got two more of these doodle dangers to do. Ah, oh, yes. Baby Archie. Wanna be the same to you? Turn around and go the opposite way. That old fucking trope. Mm -hmm. Going in circles. Well, yeah, because the game's making me. Easy to forget. Time. Yeah, I need to get some new clocks. Make up your mind. Okay. <laughs> I 
Yo, what up, lady? Is it really scary if I know that she's there and I walk into her on purpose because it's the only place I can go? I'll let you decide. The answer's no though, but... Beep. <laughs> Luckily, there was a key in that pile of rat piss. Oh, hey, bro. Rats being a rat, bro. Come here, man. I mean, it's not like I have anywhere else to go, rat. Like, fucking Jesus. Who the fuck designed this house? Only an artist would live here. What is this ratatouille or some shit? Fucking rats making my house fall down, man. Ugh. Four, eight, five, what was it? Okay, what's well, not that? Four, eight, five. Oh, God, what the fuck? Rat. Okay. Six, eight, seven. Really? Did that not work? Am I an idiot? Yes, yeah, six. Eight. Seven. What the fuck? It's clearly six, eight, seven. All right, Miss Noma. Thanks for stopping by. Maybe I need the cat to chase the rat. It's the only thing that makes sense. Three, four, three, four, one. Yep. on fire again. Great, I thought we're done with the baby shit. Ugh, we'll never be done with the baby shit, will we? Not even dead space could get away from the baby shit. July 19th. Judging by the silence that has now fallen over the house, I can safely assume that he has finally passed out. 
undoubtedly surrounded by empty bottles and tattered pieces of canvas that have become his preferred bedfellows. Every time it happens, I pray it will be the last. I pray for evidently, passionately. Our Lord in heaven, let him crack his head open and the rot spew out. Let him cut his wrists on the glass and the red bile flow. Let him choke on his own vomit so that we may all find peace. For if you don't, one day I'll find the courage to walk down the steps and end him myself. You all should know it's not the lack of will that stays his stays my hand. Amen. I'd call the carpenter. You know, this spoopy sound basically just means that, um... I'm going in the right direction. That's all that means. like I ever get confused as to which direction I need to go in this game, because it's only one direction. AKA the walking simulator. Is this supposed to be me or some shit? Looking at myself. Cool. <sighs> oh, man another bender where I dreamed about my eyeballs. Hey, I'm sorry I haven't written in a while. I've been swarmed with work. I gotta tell you, your last letter was uh, troubling, to say the least. I can't believe that she just set fire to your old paintings. Why would she do that? The lady in black? Especially if that was your tribute to her, wasn't it? I don't know what to tell you, except to get us some professional help. Pronto. You probably should talk to someone as well, with all that happened. I'm sure it would do you some good. I probably don't need to tell you that the buyer was sorely disappointed with the news. The new pieces just aren't selling as well as the classics. Anyway, now keep looking. You just hang in there and focus on your work. Uh, I know you still have it in you. I believe in you. Your best friend and agent, Thomas Cadwell. I don't. He doesn't have it in him. Yeah, that's boogie. All right. <sighs> okay, I'll pay that one. Drip, drip, boosh. Hey, what up, Fang? How you doing? Secret groups? Do you mean like a die party game? I mean, that's a role playing game, man. Tabletop role playing game. 
Hey there, princess. What? Oh, <laughs> this is daddy's medicine. Whenever daddy's hurting, this helps the hurt go away. No, don't touch that. Oh God, I'm so. Wait. You with four more I'm people? Sorry. Yeah, it's I, a role-playing game. The die party games. Mhm. Mm yep. Uh, we do them every night. I want daddy's medicine. Hell yeah, man. Uh, check the schedule if you want more information, and if you want to see the archives of those, you can check out the YouTube. Is don't look back. Got it. I won't. Instinct of self-preservation. Little pain goes a long way. That's a metaphor for how I feel playing this game. Trapped in a fucking rat maze. That painting's upside down, man. But it's illuminated, so I've got to go look at it. What's this game about? Well, from what I can tell, it's about a painter who has like creator's block. He can't make any more paintings. Or he murdered his wife and child and then used their body parts for paintings. I'm not entirely sure, to be honest with you. Just seems like an effort into making some spooky shit happen, I guess. Hickory dickory. Die. The mouse sucker upon the us cock. this cock. The cock struck one. Horror ran down. Hickory dickory. Hey, what up, Fang? <laughs> uh, uh, sorry, Richard. Welcome back. Now I'm reading the chat. the melty room. Honey, what are you doing? Okay, you're shaving? I understand. I'll leave you alone. Six three, motherfucker, get ready. Three six three. Some paintings simply defy words. 
let alone critique. A basic knowledge of a subject is an absolute must, but if one is even trying to tame them. Babyface is one such painting. This art anonymously draws tens of thousands of mediocrity enthusiasts and Sunday's attraction to affectionados. In reality, it looks like a result of a week-long art marathon of not very well-adjusted painter locked in a dark basement. Leaving aside the horrible excuse uh, execution, the painting excels in hideous. Excels in hideous, okay. Dead rat. Some black spoop. Oh, that's where I left my black spoop. Mm -hmm. Alcohol's still there. Good. Where the fuck is this thing? Uh -huh. Ah, uh, yes. I always keep my phone behind a secret case. Talk to me! Why won't you talk to me? Bitch, I'm painting. Talk to me. Tell me your name. I blow it up like a total shame. I guess I just leave the room now. Like a ball. Yeah, baby. Of course. Maybe I should dial 363. I'm looking for another false wall. Or just something, I don't know. What do I normally play? Yeah, just normally whatever. Right now we're doing spooky games. Um What the fuck am I supposed to do? leave <sighs> part like that I don't get is it, it just kind of like yep you gotta do it man gotta do the thing but what thing Come baby face, give it to me. Uh, okay. What if I just never looked up? What then? Can I just climb up? You and me, Fox, yeah. That's kind of cool. Someone answer the fucking phone? Jesus. Oh, it's me. You promise. I don't remember promising anything.
Is there like another painting I'm supposed to look at or some shit? See, like... Oh, I was meant to fall off. <laughs> okay. Uh, why would I intentionally fall off? I mean, hey, what up? It's your boy, Tiny Jeffrey. If it's an adventure game and one of the logic puzzles is like, okay, now you have to kill yourself. Sure, but there's been no, nothing in this game that states that I need to kill myself up until this point. What? They just repeated the fact that there's a dead rat in there. Silly game. Yo, what up, Cindy? It's... Oh, we're, we're, we're going back up again? Okay. I guess I wasn't supposed to fall off. Oh, wait, maybe I was. This is different. Have you played Power Drill Massacre? No, I haven't. Cool, I got this. Hello? You promise. Hey, what up? Okay, am I supposed to fall on something? That's the only thing I can think of. Nine. One. One. <laughs> ah, Americans. Americans. I'm gonna try that on the piano. <sighs> well, let's try and look for a three digit number before we go back up, I guess, huh? Maybe it's with how many different types of paintings there are. That's the only thing that I can think of. I'm gonna be stuck here fucking forever, aren't I? This guy really needs to invest in a Kindle. <laughs> 
right, kudos to be his wedding day, which was uh, the 9th of June, which is at 2. You promised! 9th of June at. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Is it different now? I'm fucking lost, guys. There was, um, but I tried that already. It was 363. It doesn't work. So, I don't know. What up, boy? Uh, can you give us a hint, uh, Riga, as to what it would be? I don't want the answer. I want. I want a hint. Is it something obvious? You just got here in this at that point, yeah. I'm thinking like look down. Okay. I'll look down. Look down. You promised.
Uh... Yeah, I don't see it. I'm guessing it has something to do with these paintings. Maybe. Oh. Are you fu- I gotta see myself on the other side of the building now. Yo, what up? It's your boy. Lost in space. <laughs> Sorry, baby. Three, five, four. Hey, here's a metaphor. Allow me to fucking beat your head in with it. something to add the how should I put it final touches a finger I needed a finger chopped it off easier than sawing a leg washed it dried it in an oven fell asleep almost burned it will I manage to pull this off got that finger fang This, am I the guy that's doing all this, by the way? I used to hate you, even now. You must feel lost, alone, helpless. Finally realize you'll always be the quintessential part. There's still a way. Finish it. This is going to be the lady in black, isn't it? Trial and error. Boop, 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 boop. We're running out of apples. It's not my fucking problem. Uh, uh, honey, I found the, I found the apples.
There once was a man full of passion, but then his wife went out of fashion. Her face was a mess. He couldn't care less. She hated the man with a passion. Never really understood how you could, uh... Wow. They call me the rat bitch. It's kind of cool. Uh, hey. It's one more rats on the other side. Wiggle, wiggle. Pick up, pick up, pick up, boom. I saw boobies. No, I don't have that. She even call an exterminator. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Like makes a shadow of a rat, but not really, because it's a video game. But yeah. There's got to be someone who's doing, like, shadow art, right? Like, a guy whose entire thing is making, like, art by, like, not making shadows a thing. Man, I should just go outside. My house is filled with spooky black shit. And clowns and dolls and dead women. Is that a shark in there? Oh, it kind of looks like a rat. Yeah, I've got a huge rat problem. Basically, the entire house is filled with black goop. Can you help? I don't know what the value of my house is going to be after this thing. What the fuck is this supposed to be? These are destroyed paintings. I guess so. The paintings that the uh, Lady in Black destroyed, I guess. Can you even paint anymore? I mean, I never really could. Uh, D. I. C. K. Yes.
You know, I just had a fucking like, for some reason my brain just went like, um, so I played <laughs> Divinity yesterday. I saw this painting, right? I literally saw this painting. I was walking in like this and like, ooh, I'll take that. Put it in my, and then I was like, I'm not playing Divinity right now. Fucking Jesus, Dave. Get it together, man. Come on. You got this. Hello? Oh, hey. Let me just, uh... Oh, this is what we're supposed to do? Sweet. I don't know what this is supposed to be a metaphor for, but it sucks. Telekinesis ring. I need to get one of those. <sighs> it's just like the ending of Cry of Fear, man. Whatever. Oh wow, I'm glad the music stopped. That was great. Vermin, Cancer, Foul Stench of House, God, oh, God the Sounds. What is taking so long? Open this fucking door! I need to go! Open up! Hell is... Oh, God. No. No, 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 no. What have you done? No! What, did he, like, burn a painting or something in here? I'm gonna kill myself? Is that how this works? <laughs> oh, so I have to hold down the mouse button? Okay. Underwater, baby down where my dead wife is. Look at that bitch there. Yo, what up? It's your boy. Slightly drowning. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Ooh, it's all just a fucking figment of my imagination. Also, don't you think you'd put some clean water in there before you just fucking, you know, drink the moon? She cut her face? Is that what she did? Cause she was using, he was using her as a muse or whatever. Haven't you ever gotten high drinking someone else's bath water? No, I can't say I have. <sighs> you gotta live life, Henley. <laughs> gotta drink that bath water. Oh look, it's a fetus in a jar. Finally, someone had to bear witness. Yeah, I couldn't close. just look at my own work. Art and the artist needed an audience. A critical eye on things. I knew what I had to do. I gouged it. Scooped it up like ice cream. Felt like a butcher. A monster, but at least there was to come something beautiful from all this filth. Oh, so, okay. I get you. It's me. Buddy Mickey. Oh, dude, I have fucking... Okay, this explains it all. I have goddamn fucking lamb chops. I have fucking lamb chops. No wonder, no wonder I'm fucking crazy.
You're not gonna let me finish the fucking painting. Is that how we're doing this shit now? Guess I look at myself in the mirror. Ew. Is that a drank vaginas? Oh boy, checkers. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I mean, there's two things that are illuminated right now. I need to follow this cable, which ends right there, so mystery solved. Oh. Gotta find the checkered pieces. I feel like the way that this game was developed. It didn't really, like the story just kind of came together as they made the game. You know what I mean? What a weird fucking painting that is. Follow the laughing child. Oh, my kid is a metaphor for a giant rat. How inappropriate. Yo, you're fucking cheating! It's not how you play checkers. Oh, nice. It's the swastika of babies. I like it. So you guys are in a hairy situation. That's probably the scariest thing in this game. The dog having too many eyes. I get that I'm... I know what I'm supposed to do, I just can't fucking find it. And like, I can't crouch or nothing. I can just zoom in and that's about as much as I can do. I just crank that shit. Yeah. 
banging tunes. Womp, womp, womp. I'll, um... I'll, uh, sample this for my next, uh, album with Kanye West. Don't worry, guys. We got it. We'll call it Real Life. If I could find the fucking thing, that would be real great. But it's fucking small, and that's the thing I need to find, you see? Maybe it's like... Maybe where there's another hairbrush? Some fucking shit. There's a hairbrush there, but. Baby swastika, have you seen that stupid little thing I'm supposed to find? Ugh. This is taking all like the atmosphere out of this game, like when this shit happens. Do I have to find the pieces then? So I also gotta do something with this. Unless it's like just bugged for me or some shit. What the fuck? Okay. Game. Thanks. It's not like I wasn't looking over there or anything. Ugh, whatever. Did I really look though? Did I really take it in? Pretty sure I did. So what, the baby's up here now? Yo, what up? I'm looking for small shit. Seen any small shit up in this bitch? Who are you playing with? Who are you even playing with? Is the fucking kid is stillborn? Is... Is that what's gonna happen? It's gonna be like, We never had a child, but I bought all this shit for it, and I bought all these dolls. Is that how it's gonna go, game? You gonna fucking play that shit? Tried and true, motherfucker.
kitchen time. Yo, we don't have enough fucking apples. Is that a human brain? Dog. Baby in the oven? Lady and dudes in the oven. It's a metaphor for his wife being a cool guy. Got some H2O? Sweet. Twenty one grams. What? It's a lot of checkers pieces. I guess there's two more checkers pieces that I need to find. Oh hey, it's me, Baby Joe. What up? Ah, it wasn't Baby Joe at all. Tricked ya. Okay, you got me, Baby Joe. Okay. What the? I get it now. I'm the white male. Oh my god. I understand everything. I understand the oppression. I understand everything. Oh, it's red pill. No, it's not. <laughs> And we're back. Who's ready to fucking finish this painting? I am. I used to hate you. I think even now I still might. I know how you must feel lost, alone, helpless. You probably deserve it. And the one precious thing you ever truly desired. You will never finish it. Ba-dum, 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 bum, bum. Mona Lisa. Oh, she's beautiful. Yes! That's it! <laughs> it's beautiful. Is he gonna be missing a finger? Perfect. Just like I always imagined. Whoa. What, what is this? I, I don't understand. <laughs> no. That's kinda cool. Stop it. Please! I was so close! This time... I almost had it! What a twist! <laughs> Alright. Well, I need to go buy more milk, I guess. Yo, what up, baby Joe? You're the only other one that un truly understood me. My dearest wife, I know that things the past few months have been devastating. I know that I should have been more supportive, more caring, more selfless. I still can't believe some of the things I said to you. 
I guess I was never meant to be a great husband or father. I thought I could be a great artist, but that dream has ended as well. In its absence, I will do my best to treat you with all the love and compassion you deserve. You are the love of my life, my muse. You will never read this letter. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's kind of nice. In a, I killed my wife and now she's dead kind of way. that key doesn't open that door this time. I know you must feel alone, hopeless, lost. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there's still a way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you truly desired. Finish it. took two and a half hours it wasn't a very long game <laughs> yeah there was a I, I don't know this this game was kind of like like you can't scare someone with a walking simulator right in order to scare someone you need to you need to have a lot of things the the first being like a sense of safety and then you take that safety away from someone right if the game is constantly berating you from all sides it just loses its impact like <laughs> there's a moment in this game where i opened a cupboard and bottles fell on me and that was legitimately the scariest fucking part of the game for me because other than that it was just like just fucking like insane visions and shit like that you know like apparently there's alternative ending where you get different portraits like challenges avoid the wife things and collect all the x interesting that's kind of cool i think the idea here is that um you know uh, uh they got married she was a outstanding artist or something maybe they had uh, a child maybe they didn't i like to think that they got married um and uh then the husband ignored her they had a baby but it died during birth and all the things were just baby things that never got used. Either that or they had the child. Well, no, they must have had the child because there was painting, a uh, kid drawing everywhere. So they had the kid, and the dad just saw it as a fucking rat. That's what I think. In order to get these ending, you must collect all the whispered words that relate to the passions of the character while avoiding items related to his wife. 
avoid all mirrors, chairs, and most of all her ghost that appears in episode 4 and 5. You should also avoid death and you should follow the rats by collecting their drawings. What the fuck? That's that's pretty interesting. I feel like they put more time in the inter into the alternative ending than they did into making the game longer than two hours. Don't look back. Okay. That's what they left us on. Just don't look back. Don't look back. So, okay, the husband gets his leg broken from a horse riding accident. She almost got burned alive, so maybe she gave birth after the hospital. I thought the child was horrible. Weird game, not too spoopy. Yeah. It was weird. It was weird. Hmm. Alright, well, um, I know I haven't been streaming long, but I think I'm gonna leave it there, mostly because, like, I, I don't know what's going on, I'm fucking just drained, I'm just fucking drained, just tired, so I want to spend some time with the lady and the pup. How you doing, pup? He's just sleeping. Uh, but yeah. Uh, thanks very much for watching guys. If you haven't already done so, consider following the channel. Uh, and if you're feeling saucy, why not subscribe? Uh, get access to the cockpit and the best emotes on Twitch. Um, you wanna say hello, Ronan? You wanna say hello? Um, but yeah, uh, tonight we have the second episode of Die Party, uh, Dead Man's Crest, which is, uh, you know, a game that we started a month ago or two months ago. And, uh, <laughs> um, and Ronan ain't afraid of no ghost. No, he is not. Uh, but yeah, uh, because of the hurricanes and stuff that we never got to the cursed dead man's crest. Yes, we never we never got back to it um, But tonight we are everyone's ready to go. It's gonna be great. Even Ronan's ready to go. Look at him. He's a sleepy bum He's been sleeping all day ready for this shit Satellite doggo will protect you. Yes, he will Yes, he will. So yeah guys, thanks for watching um, we gonna bounce, Ronan. We gonna bounce so hard. But yeah, uh, make sure you come back tonight, 5 p.m. PST. It's gonna be amazing. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs>